an Eyewitness News special. And welcome back to the X Zone, live from the Home Depot Center. Let's send it over to Kurt Sandoval because, Curtis, they're always looking for the next big thing, and I think you have the answer. I think you're right, Rob. In the 13 years of the X Games, the one constant is they keep raising the bar. So what's next? I may have found what's next. It's called Freeline. Ryan Farrelly invented Freeline skates and quickly learned, by way of the school of hard knocks, it's imperative to stay on your feet if you get off balance. The wheels only go sideways. You never want to position your foot going forward. It's all about going sideways on these. The skaters stand sideways, but the company has hit fast forward. The first 18 months of the business soared by simply stopping at places like this at Venice Beach. Just word of mouth, grassroots style. People like it, they start talking about it. Now we're in 30 countries around the world and, and growing strong. I would never want anyone to stop skateboarding. We're merely offering a new challenge. We're the next ride. Ryan says Freeline is a cross between surfing, skateboarding, and snowboarding. Really, it's it's its own sport. You can't really say it's like them, but you can say it, it has the same feeling as sometimes. It's safe because you can slide just like a snowboard slides hmm. or like a skateboard slides from side to side. Mm -hmm. You don't have to look very far to see that Freeline could be on the X Games agenda in the near future. That's a goal. These started for downhill. We can push 40, 50 miles per hour, no problem. Ryan's from San Francisco. That's where he was reaching speeds of 40 and 50 miles per hour. Honestly, in that quick couple of hours at Venice Beach, there were hundreds of kids asking, where can I get these? They're